Merry Christmas everybody, Martinez here with a Christmas special today and before we get into the beef jerky of things let's talk about moderation and I'm not talking about drinking or should I say not just about drinking it's always good to enjoy moderation when it comes to uh, you know the sweets and stuff like that you don't want to gain too much extra weight during the holiday season and also it is best to enjoy moderation family and friends because it doesn't take long before you end up in a real bad cousin Eddie type situation if you know what I mean so with that being said moving on to the jerky now I must have either been a really good boy or or I was really really good at hiding my naughty side either way Santa came a day early no I don't have jerky from the North Pole but I do have jerky straight from Columbus Nebraska which is just right down the road from me here um, this is TNT beef jerky it's actually made by a uh, wild wild west uh, or west wild west barbecue uh, catering company I guess I, I've never heard of them before um, they got three varieties from what I could research online they got a original, a mild, and what we're going to be trying out today is the hot. Okay, so uh, doing some more research, I found that you can find this stuff uh, obviously in Columbus, but you can find it in Humphrey, North Bend, Schuyler, uh, let's see, David City, uh, and there's some more locations coming soon. But, you know, I got a lot of family in those areas. So if any of you guys are watching this and want to try some good jerky here, I'm going to let you know what I think of this stuff here. Um, now right off the bat, I'm looking at the ingredients on this thing here. And we got beef uh, beef jerky, so it's Worcestershire sauce and soy sauce, which is uh, two main ingredients that I like to use when I make my homemade jerky. Uh, one thing that kind of stands out to me on this one is they do use Tabasco sauce and a liquid smoke. So I'm kind of curious if they actually smoke this jerky or if they just use a dehydrator. Either way, it's going to be fine to me because I'm going to enjoy it either way. Um, but they also have habanero pepper extract. So I'm hoping since it's an extract, uh, from what I've gathered, is that generally that makes it a little bit more spicier. So we're about to find out here about that real quick here. So... I guess without further ado here, let's see if I can open this bad boy up. Maybe not. Let's see. Uh, might go from bad to worse here. There we go. Now, as far as the price goes on this, I see it's marked at $6.50. And it's only a 2.3 ounce bag. I'd definitely say this is more on the pricier side. And we're about ready to find out if it's worth the money or not. Definitely has a habanero smell to it. It's uh, more on the dry side, which is fine. That's exactly how I love it. I love it that way. So let's go ahead and uh, take a first bite here. I never had this before, so... Uh, let's uh, go into this together, I guess. Oh, wow. That is really good. It is real dry. Kind of breaks off in your mouth a little bit. Mmm. You know, we talked about moderation. Beef jerky, I don't think has moderation, but there is only so much your human body can take of it. So keep that in mind. Now, right here on the bag, it says some say it's hot, some say it's not. You be the judge, and you know I gotta say it is a little bit on the spicier side there. As I chomped up on that second piece or that second part of that first piece. Uh, yeah, I can feel some heat. Catching me in the back of my throat. So, that's definitely worth the buy. Is it something I'd go out and buy every week? Mm, 
Not for the money, I don't think. I'm still somewhat of a, a tight wall when it comes to that. But, anyways, guys, I hope that everybody has a Merry Christmas. Play it safe out there. If you uh, ever find yourself a chance to get uh, some TNT beef jerky here, I definitely recommend it. Um, it looks to be more of a localized area from where I'm from here in uh, Nebraska, Norfolk and Columbus and Schuyler, North Bend, uh, Humphrey area. So anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that like button and do subscribe. I will get, keep you guys up to date here. I look forward to doing some more videos and trying some more uh, more jerky like this one here today. Like I said, this is the first time for me. I've never had this kind of stuff before. And I am sure glad that Santa brought it for me. You guys have a wonderful night.